want to see how I created this beautiful red and gold holiday tablescape? Keep watching to find out exactly how I did it. Welcome to Artsy Cupcake. My name is Maria and I share tips on the art of life, home, health, and style. I do fashion lookbooks, helpful reviews, home decorating, and healthy recipe videos. So if you like those types of things, please consider subscribing to my channel. Today I'm participating in the Christmas DIY Decor Challenge hosted by the DIY Mommy. There will be a playlist with a bunch of other Christmas DIYs on her channel. I just did a centerpiece video last week on my small dinette area. And now I'm moving on to the formal dining room, which will get a lot of attention during the holidays. So I want to dress it up with a very elegant tablescape. And I'm going to show you how I transitioned from my fall tablescape into my Christmas tablescape and you will get to see the whole process from start to finish. For fall, I had created this simple yet elegant tablescape with the gourds and the pumpkins. Most everything came from home goods or Target. If you want the details and want to see how I decorated the rest of my home for fall, I will link that video below. I have loved how this looked for the past month or so, but I'm in the holiday spirit, so let's switch it up. I use red and gold for all of my Christmas decorations, but really you could go with whatever color that you want and this would look just as gorgeous. So the first thing I did was clean off all my fall decorations. I think I will reuse that tray because having a tray on top of the tablecloth creates a nice unified space to collect all the small items that add to the cheer. I know I will be using ornaments, so the tray will help to keep them in place and not have them rolling all over the table during dinner. I had bought this large box of vase filler at Home Goods, and I kept the box, so I pulled that back out to store them away until after the holidays. I will use two of those candles because they will add some height to the tablescape without being intrusive to dinner conversations. This is a great time to go ahead and clean and iron your table linens and wash those dishes. Also, it's a good time to give the table a good dusting like I did here. I'm using the Method Wood for Good Daily Clean with a microfiber cloth. I found this velour tablecloth at Home Goods for, I think it was under $20. It's from the Cynthia Rowley brand and it's a really great size and high quality. I grabbed that tray and the candles to start this project. I found this reindeer centerpiece at Michael's, but if you can't find this exact one, really any nice large piece in the center will look good. Last year I used an angel tree topper and she looked really pretty there too. I found these individual pieces of garland in a pack of 20 at Target. They are perfect for a tablescape, so you can customize them to fit anything. I worked with these for a little bit and tried to keep things symmetrical on the table until I got them looking just right around the candles. Then I incorporated some gold and red glass ornaments that I had found at Target, and I made sure to point the area that has the hook and I put that downwards. And whenever there was garland that you could see the stem or like those ornaments with the um, place where you put the hook, I used these poinsettias to help hide those areas that didn't look finished. I found these bells at Target and I used them to fill in any other empty spaces. They are gold so they blend in nicely with the tray and they add a nice texture to the whole tablescape. Next I brought out the placemats and the dinnerware. I like that I have a gold palette as my base for all my decor because then I don't have to spend money on new placemats or napkins for every season. I folded the napkin and tucked it under the plates and then took the napkin ring and placed these small bottle brush trees in the center. I found these little trees at Target in a pack of four. Next I put out these red glitter coasters that I found in the dollar section at Target and I placed some wine glasses on top. And here's a close-up of the finished product. 
so elegant and simple and I love the individual attention to each place setting with those little trees. Well, I hope my tablescape gave you some creative ideas for holiday decorating. If you wanna see how I decorated my dinette area, I will put that link below. It was only $10 and super easy with all my Dollar Tree finds. I'm wanting to build a happy community here on Artsy Cupcake, and I would just love to get to know you. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a very happy day.